All right, this is going to be a quick uh, tutorial on how to use Google Bookmarks. Uh, and I like using it right in the iGoogle page rather than going to the website itself. Um, here's my Google Reader over on the right side of the page. And you'll notice that there's some unread items here. Like, I'll, I'll just check this just as I normally do. Um, this is a post by Larry Ferlazzo. Looks like there's a science link that I might be interested in. All I have to do, let's say I really like what he shares here. Looks like it might be a few uh, games that deal with some subjects that you might deal with in middle school science. Looks like there's some other subjects too. Whatever. Um, let's say I like it. I am going to copy that. Just control C once I highlight the URL. I'll go right back to my iGoogle page and once I do that um, I'll go to Google Bookmarks let's see I'll X out here let's say I want to save that in my science websites folder so I have a bunch of sites that I've saved already in this folder I'm just gonna add a bookmark paste it in Call it bite size science activities. I can add a, additional labels. I could use that in uh, web tools folder maybe too. Click add and it's saved. Anytime I want to find that, I can look under my science websites and I can find that, that site. But you can go through your reader and if you find something that you interest, or interest you, um, you can save it right into Google Bookmarks right on your iGoogle page. Um, you could also do the same, let's say you find something on Twitter, some guy has a really cool post that you enjoyed reading and you want to show it to somebody else later, but you don't have access to email or something like that. I don't know why you wouldn't have access to email, but you want to save it and you want to read it later or you want to show somebody. So you can copy the, it the same way any anywhere any website that you know of you can copy it and you can save it into Google bookmarks